Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here, and in today's GTA 5 video, we're going to be talking about some more interesting details regarding what looks to be the next update in Grand Theft Auto Online. So the too long didn't read version, apparently the next update is going to be a consolidation or a combination of all of our businesses coming together. The biker stuff, the gun running stuff, the CEO stuff, the uh, import export stuff. All of that is going to be coming together. Well, we have some more details from FunMW2 and XXII that sort of might give us some insight on how this is going to work. And it almost seems as if it's going to be very much free mode based, like more than normal. And it also looks like it has to do with drug dealing as well, which might only be one part of it. That might be like the combination of the biker stuff, or that actually might be the overall crime syndicate that I believe is going to be taking over our businesses, whether that's the cartel or whether that's, you know, something else. Uh, but anyways, let's jump into it. So let's talk about what FunMW2 has actually mentioned first. His post is pretty interesting. He said he found this. He found B-B-T-I-K-O-A, the string for the new event. It's like pen underscore knock P, which was knocked out of penned in, where pen refers to penned in. What do you think the B-B-T-I refers to? K-O stands for knockout. A is a string variant. He says by business time question mark. That doesn't make sense. And a lot of people started throwing their guesses into the ring of what BBT actually means. I definitely think it has something to do with business, but I'm not too sure. The things we do know is it's going to be very similar to Penned In. If you guys have never played it, this is a free mode event that was added back in 2015, where basically you get a group of guys with cars, you follow this circle that gets smaller. If you get knocked out of it, you blow up basically. So apparently there's going to be something regarding our businesses in a style similar to penned in, but we're not sure how that's going to work. I was never a big fan of the free mode events that Rockstar added back in 2015, so I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm a little bit skeptical of this. Now, when someone asked if this was for this DLC or the next DLC, FunMW2 said the next update. It's a different version of penned in that would be added as a new CEO work or free mode event. So keep in mind, guys, this is probably only one part of the DLC, and there's a chance Rockstar left this in the files of this update for maybe one or two reasons. One, maybe they wanted us to find it and then start talking about it, thus generating and building hype, or they've added little pieces of the update in this DLC because it's so big. That way, when they introduce the next DLC, they won't have to add as much content. Those are my two theories on why they did that. And because of that, they've left us little clues and hints like this that give us maybe an idea of some of the new VIP or CEO work or a free mode event that's going to be coming along with the next update. So that honestly sounds pretty interesting. Now, the next thing that's kind of interesting comes from XXII. The other day, we talked about some drug-related code lines that he had actually found in the files. Well, he said this. He said all the drug-related code lines added and updated that I had shown three days ago are related to free mode events. So this sort of backs up what FunMW2 says, but he says, but in this update, there are no free mode events related to this. Hashtag GTA Online. So there's definitely going to be something in the next update, the consolidation of all of our businesses that's supposed to be one of the biggest DLCs of all time, that might be the final Grand Theft Auto Online update. Uh, it's going to have a lot to do with free mode events. And XXII's finding is interesting because it's drug-related stuff. So it almost kind of begs the question, are we going to be doing sort of like drug dealing in GT Online? More of like a free mode aspect to the biker businesses. So even though the biker businesses are in free mode, it's really just push a button, watch your stock grow, sell it. There's nothing really interactive about it. So it kind of makes me wonder if that's what Rockstar are going to be doing with this DLC. Or if once again, this is something more closely related to like the cartel or a crime syndicate or something like that. So I'm definitely excited to see the dynamic that Rockstar is going to try and use to pull something like this off. Right now, I'm pretty excited, but I'm also a little bit skeptical because I know I was not a big fan of the free mode events update. I mean, I'm not a big fan of penned in either. I'm not sure how excited that really gets anyone watching this video right now. But who knows? Maybe this event, maybe this free mode stuff could be really cool. I guess we're honestly just going to have to wait and see. But anyways, that's all the information that I'm going to be talking about for you guys in this video today. Hopefully you did enjoy. Let me know in the comments down below, what do you think the findings from FunMW2 and XXII mean for the next Grand Theft Auto Online DLC? 
Do you think it has something to do with some random free mode event? Do you think drug dealing in some way, shape, or form is going to be involved? Keep in mind, drug dealing was one of the original cut content from GT Online. And we've seen Rockstar add plenty of cut content back into the game. So I think there's a good chance they add this again going forward in the future. So like I said, let me know your thoughts, opinions, more in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys down there. If you did go on to enjoy this video, though, a like rating would, of course, be awesome. And also subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new. We like daily GTA 5 videos like this. With all the way, guys, like I said, thanks so much for watching. Take care. And I'll see you guys in the next video.